it's been a while since we won, so we definitely needed that. Um, I mean, obviously we wanted to break the streak, so it's a good way to go now on the road for three games after winning one game. How did you feel out there today? You seemed very, very fluid. You seemed to see the court really well. How different were you out there today than maybe the last few games? I wasn't thinking today. The last couple of games, I was thinking. I had a conversation with my mood, and I'm not good when I think. I'm, it's all instincts with me, and it doesn't mean I'm going to be perfect, but I'm going to be myself. And when I think, I'm not myself, so that's what I was doing today, just being myself out there. A lot more smiles from you out on the court today, too. I mean, we were winning, too, so... <laughs> Talk about the, the fourth quarter, the comeback they made, and how you guys were able to fend it off. Yeah, that was scary. Um, that was scary, but I think sometimes when you get a big lead, you tend to relax, especially late in the game, and I think that's that's kind of what happened with us. Give them confidence. And once you relax to that extent, it's a little bit hard to pick up yourself back to where you were playing to that level. Um, but I'm just happy we, we were able to come up with the win. Recovering from the injury and starting out the season slow, how much does this do for you and your confidence? I'm always confident in myself. Like I said, if I think, then I'm not myself. Uh, I, I never, I never lose confidence in myself. I mean, last game, three for twelve from three. And this game, I came aggressive. You know, it's, I just got to be myself, and the rest, whatever happens, happens. With a lot of injuries and people out, um, talk about what you can do and what other people. Other players can do to keep that momentum going during the game. I gotta, I gotta bring the energy every day. Uh, it'll be more challenging, obviously, because we have less players available, which means more minutes being played. So you get fatigued. Um, but that, that's not gonna be an excuse. You know, we're we lost a lot of games, so it's time to win some. And whatever it takes, that's what we gotta do. We have a tough uh, road of December games coming up. Uh, only two games at home. Talk about what needs to be done to have a strong month of December. Yeah, I mean, guys need to be focused. We definitely need to stay hydrated. We don't need any any other injuries, any cramps, any any of that stuff. And <clears throat> we really just got to focus game by game. We can't think about the whole month when we have one game uh, next. That's that's all we got. That's that's got to be the mentality. That's got to be the mindset. And. Uh, I mean, we have the pieces, man. There's obviously there's no secret to that. We just we got to put it together and build from from today. You shot well over 50 percent from the field tonight. How important is your offensive efficiency to the team's success? Um, obviously, every time anybody's efficient, it's, it's going to help. Uh, but more importantly, most importantly, I I, I got a lead. I got a I got a role. Uh, and I had to organize the offense and stuff. Um, and I mean, I, I, I had way too many turnovers today, so that's something I got to work on. But you know, today was a good night for me, and we ended up winning, so that's a that's a win-win for me. And in your opinion, in what ways did the defense help snag the win tonight? Um, I think we took advantage of the fact that they have they had a back-to-back. And we came locked in defensively. We, we did, a, did a great job bringing energy, being sharp on the switches, and doing all what we're supposed to be doing. Um, and again, at, at any time you get defensive stops, it's going to give you a lot of confidence on offense. And it showed today we were sharing the ball, making shots, and having fun, which is the most important thing.